hello guys welcome back to innovative design tutorial so guys today we are going to create this spool design in solidworks i hope you will enjoy our tutorial and this video helps you uh, more uh, you like to learn uh, piping in, in uh, solidworks i hope you will like it thanks for watching so we have to create so go to the file select assembly okay so here we just enter the assembly now we change the color to plain white okay go to the solid wash add-ins and now here we select solid wash routing so click on it and now we select on piping and here we select start by drag and point so uh, otherwise you will go to from this side also so go to the piping now here we select flange here we select slip on flange and click and press with uh, right uh, key of mouse and drag to this windows okay the sizes we will keep it uh, uh, 3 inch uh, and uh, class will be 300 okay now we first save this spool to our uh, desktop like uh, anywhere you want to save here we will name it spool 8 now we save all okay now here uh, windows pop-up is open this is the 300 uh, class uh, flange slip on flange here it will ask pipe size and schedule so we will keep 3 inch pipe schedule 40 okay so look uh, how we do this now it's time to increase the length of this pipe so simply select this point and drag up uh, otherwise uh, depend on you where we keep to increase the length so if you not uh, find the suitable direction so we press a uh, tab key now here exit this sketch again we have to apply the uh, reducer 2 inch uh, sorry uh, 3 inch to 2 inch line so we have to go to the reducer select co-centric reducer and now select this point drag here we will select reducer 3 into 2 inch and schedule we will keep it 40 ok so again we just uh, apply the flange to this point so we will keep a 2 inch flange and rating will be 150 so we have to just uh, put this uh, flange here so it's time to apply the dimension to this uh, spool so go to the smart dimension we have to just select this flange face and this point here we will keep it uh, length 469 mm just uh, okay so So here we just select this face, this one and this point. So here we have to, uh, first we just see the drawing. So uh, 469 is uh, not suitable. So first we have to put uh, this uh, uh, length from this uh, reducer center to this flange uh, we have to just uh, check it 387 uh, from this uh, height now select this line to this uh, first we select this point to this flange in and where we will keep it 100 gap okay now again we select this point and this flange end face select 
and make this length 469 mm okay so look uh, how we uh, put the dimension of this spool so here it's time to apply the material so go to the appearance select jing select matte jing now simply select and drag to this pipe okay and this one also and the flanges reducer we will keep the steel polish steel so it looks much better so we will keep this uh, material appearance so we will keep the polish steel to this flange reducer elbow So guys, this is the basic tutorial of piping uh, for beginner student who want to learn piping in SOLIDWORKS. So this is the great tutorial and uh, great software for 3D modeling. I hope you will enjoy it. Thanks for watching.